And today on Price Check, we're going to take a look at something a little different. Here we have, uh, we're going to look at some Prussian German military items. Here we have a World War I uh, officer's sword selling for $375. Not bad. And if you can, if you see this, you know, it, it looks like a little, uh, little is the wrong word. It looks like a cavalry saber that one would... I uh, kind of throw about um, and I would wonder if this in World War One was far more for show because it does not appear to have had strenuous use and let's look here we've got another Calvary Saber uh, World War One 1889 uh, so this probably saw some earlier action as a uh, uh, Prussian item um, and we do this one does uh, appear to be a little bit more worn but still in rather nice shape uh, so possibly you know set aside here we have a uh, soldier pipe so uh, adjacent category combining tabacchiana and militaria and that is actually rather fetching and what do we have this made out of well it has a sterling silver wind wind top to keep your light going and looks like we've got some german hallmarks that are faded there this is a rather fetching antique piece that i am not surprised at all pushed down for 358 dollars where did we start $29.99. And we have another World War I Prussian sword to look at. Here we have a little bit different of a hilt. This is a gold brass color. And again, we have that same, uh, same shape for the cavalry sword. And it looks like somebody has added a uh, later uh, fabric hold. But no, looking at that, that might actually be uh, leather... Uh, from the time period, so who knows, but rather nice piece selling for $380 and here we have a beer stein with the Prussian royal emblem on top That is not Prussian royal emblem. This is rather just a Prussian item a very nice honeycomb shape to this and I would guess uh, pewter metal around the outside and just a fine porcelain lid dating to 1874 very nice and finally we have a prussian eagle uh, 800 continental silver chain uh, hard to imagine who would have worn this um, but it is certainly authentic and we have the silver markings as well as good signs of age there and overall kind of a rather curious item so i know i said that was going to be more military than it was um, let's actually take a look here and see if we can't find one more cool military item. Uh, I will skip the cigar cutter because I think that is cool, but it is not a good military item. And let's see. We have a World War One Iron Cross. That is very cool. And here we've got the real deal. There's a lot of reproductions of these out there. You know, you see them right here, Reproduction World War One, Black Helmet, etc. This is the real deal metal. Would have been quite heavy to wear. Selling for $965. Well, hopefully you learned something here. And even if you didn't, I appreciate it if you like and subscribe so you can support the channel. And as always, I hope you have a great day.